see the top six hottest new construction homes in the Portland Metro. Well, this video, we're gonna to be touring the six brand new homes in the... Northwest Street of Dreams. Northwest Street of Let's Dreams. <laughs> Gotta get some excitement going. <laughs> Gotta want it, dude. This is the 2019 Northwest Street of Dreams right here in Frog Pond, part of Wilsonville. That's right, and we did a video on this a little while ago, but anyways, you're gonna see the top six brand new nicest construction homes in Portland. So stay tuned. What's going on everybody? This is Jackson Ray Wilkie and Jesse Ray Dow and we are the Real Agent Now group right here in the Portland Metro and if you've wanted to know what some of the newest construction homes look like in the Portland Metro well this video is going to be all about it but if you have not yet make sure you hit that subscribe button tap that little bell because we're doing videos all the time about what it's like to live in the Portland Metro and we have people calling us from all around the world who are relocating here and need our help finding their home and we absolutely love it. So honestly, people, if you're thinking about moving to the Portland Metro or Southwest Washington, make sure you give us a call, shoot us a text, email us, direct message us, or send the pigeon carriers however you wanna get a hold of us. We got your back when moving to the Portland Metro. This is an event that I go to every year um, it is absolutely amazing to see the work that these builders put into these houses. Like it's their own home. Uh, so much pride on every single finish. It's truly remarkable. So I'm just cruising from my house and headed to Frog Pond, very up and coming area uh, in Wilsonville. Wilsonville's exploded in the last, you know, 10, 12 years. And Frog Pond, this development is just kicking off uh, what's going to be developed out there and to start off with such high-end homes I'm really excited about this area and what it'll bring to the Portland Metro. It's a great Opportunity to live just south of Portland um, And you'll get a lot more house for your money out there so heading there right now should be there in about 15 20 minutes and uh, Start diving into seeing these homes We made it, let's go check these out. Actually supposed to meet Jesse here real soon so we can get the uh, bird in the air, show a little drone footage. Mr. J. Dow finally made it. Yep. We can see the homes right here. What are you most excited to see today, you think? I think just like the new concepts of the new Street of Dreams, modern home styles, ADUs down here, out in farm country. It's a bunch of like fields around here. This is really gonna kick this frog pond off and they're starting to build giant new construction homes with ADUs in them. So we're gonna see that too. A great opportunity for nanny quarters or mother-in-law quarters. So waiting to get in here. Square feet, four beds, five bath, beautiful waterfall countertops, wolf appliances, chef's kitchen. Look at that hood, dude. One ton sub zero fridge. Dream living, 20 plus foot tall ceiling, ship lap, wide open, beautiful home. to number two two got a comeback to see this single level ranch 4,000 square feet double masters three beds three and a half bath all 
All right, what's the difference between this house and the first one we went to? Yeah, this is very traditional. Uh, it looks like we have crafts, custom, cabinetry, quartz countertop still, thermidor, oven, six top burner, instant fill, instant hot pot filler, cool backsplash, but it's very, um, it's not as open and spacious as the other one. So yeah, if you like the traditional style, this is probably gonna be the home for you. It's also a single level ranch. So. What was the price on this bad boy? Make an offer. Any of you YouTube subscribers out there, want a big traditional home it says make an offer so this could be yours i'm gonna try that nebula nine mule ready hold on cheers whoa you can't keep touring these homes without a little cocktail break now they're promising it's Nebula vodka. Is it Nebula? Something like yeah, that? Yeah, Nebula, no hangover. No hangover, we'll apparently. We'll be the judges of that. I'll have like 70. But we're heading to uh, house number three. It's a perfect day out here. You just can't get better weather than this. So we're gonna go into, I believe. Joanna Gaines style. Joanna Gaines, which has always been my favorite whenever we're touring. So I'm excited to see this one for Five sure. Five beds, four and a half bath, priced at 1.8 million. That's easy money. Easy money, baby. Easy money, but I can see it right now. It looks absolutely amazing. If you saw our Wilsonville video, this is the street we pulled in on, so we're gonna be heading there right now. Finally, a house with a little bit bigger backyard. That's the kind of house I would like. Big slider glass windows, all open, Joanna Gaines style. So you're seeing a lot of shiplap, white, open, beautiful. You don't see the corner slider like double slider much so that's definitely a wow factor this one has less of a yard but the ultimate entertaining space for sure Fireplace. That must be the new thing, the herringbone in the backsplash of the fireplace. Got a little sanctuary out here. Is this a she shed? That's a she shed. That's, a she shed. That's what she shed. <laughs> <laughs> So we're going into the last house here on the Street of Dreams. Another beautiful modern looking concept. Um, 
These are just fantastic homes. Really setting the bar high for uh, what's gonna go on here in Frog Pond. But let's go in here, follow Jesse, and go to the last house. This just puts you in the vibe of entertainment. That's, you know, what a lot of these are. Super good for entertaining, wide open spaces, a lot of fun. All right, so we just finished touring all six of these homes. This is one of the pickiest guys I know. So what were some of the good features you saw? I loved all of the uh, gourmet chef's kitchens, like the Wolf Appliances, Gen Air. Um, I loved all the open floor plans. I loved the backyard, outdoor, indoor living space, which was really cool. A lot of masters, every single house had masters on the main. Yep. Great spaces for kids. All of them had hardwood floors. All the latest technology. Landscaping was done to a T. Just very, very cool to see the new 2019 concepts and all the, the cool little designs and attentions and details that you don't see in any of the other homes out there. But as for this year, I'm really impressed and really happy to see what the builders had to come up with. But like Jesse said, there's buildable lots. Yep. Um, there's a lot of room here where you could come and, and build your dream home here. And it's gonna be cheaper than Lake Oswego, but it's just south of it. So um, great areas around here. But anyways, that finishes our tour here um, of the 2019 Natural... Uh, 2019 Northwest Natural Street of Dreams. That's right, there it is. And uh, we really appreciate you watching it. But literally, if you're thinking about moving here to the Portland Metro, we've had so many people call us and reach out and we've been helping them and we absolutely love it. So if you are moving here, make sure you shoot us a call, send us a text, send the direct message, email us, send the pigeon carrier. However you wanna get a hold of us, we're here and we got your back when moving to Portland. And if you have not yet subscribed, make sure you tap that subscribe button and click that little bell so you're notified every time we do a new video about what it's like, fans, yeah, about what it's like to live here in the Portland Metro. So until the next video, we'll catch you later. Let's go get that vodka lemonade. Let's go get the vodka. Had to get a little nighttime footage before we rolled out. Z-Bay! Z-Bay! Shocking! He has the camera. That's right! <laughs>